Hello everyone, welcome back to another tutorial. Uh, I'm gonna teach you how to create virtual reality applications with Unity. This is a basic tutorial and includes five steps. Uh, installation of Unity Hub, Unity Editor, Visual Studio and the dependencies and the uh, basics of uh, Unity VR in overall. So first step is just copy paste, install Unity Hub inside the Google and then you will have the first link click on it and then uh, download the Unity Hub since we are using Windows so click on this one and then you will have the Unity Hub set up double click on it Then it will install. So I'm just putting everything on default. And then it's run Unity Hub. Unity Hub is basically a hub to uh, serve uh, the Unity editors. We will have different versions for the Unity editors. So let's do that. So uh, I need to sign in. For that, we need to create an account. And then you might select a password and then a username. So the username should be unique. So I am putting just some random value and then a full name. Then once we create the account, the, the Unity Hub, and then we agree with the licensing because Unity is free. So we skip the installation. And here, now we have a Unity Hub, you have your account and then, so this is the project that I have nothing and the installs for the Unity editor I don't have. So the first thing is putting install editor and then uh, here we need to find uh, the versions. So because the version that I'm looking for is not here, then uh, I'm gonna go to the archive and then download archive. So it will provide all the versions. So what I'm looking for is 2022 3.16. So I'm clicking on the UniHub and then uh, it will automatically come here, right? So, and this LTS means that long-term support, which means that uh, they are supporting this version even though we passed a couple of years later. So if you build a project here, then they will support this version. So you don't get to any terrible or problem in future. So for that, uh, we need to also install the Visual Studio. So I'm gonna select this one and then uh, I don't want this and then continue. It takes a little bit time. Okay, when you see this, we need to install additional dependency. So for that, we need this net desktop development and then game development with Unity. So, and then uh, I'm gonna just install this. Again, we will wait a couple of minutes to for this one to, to be installed. Then, when it's installed, then you will see 
sign in to the usual stuff. We don't need to sign in. It's just a skip and then uh, start the Visual Studio. Then basically you would have the, the Visual Studio like this. Then we are going to close it and then close this one. So now if you go to the install, then we have these versions 